Hey guys, what's up everyone? I'm really excited to talk about avoiding common pitfalls on the Walmart.com marketplace. So, let's get right into it. First things first, you absolutely need to understand Walmart.com quote S marketplace policies. These policies are like the rule book for your success. And trust me, you don't want to break any rules. Take the time to read through them carefully, and if anything's unclear, don't hesitate to reach out to Walmart seller support. Now let's talk about proper listing optimization. This is huge. Your listings are basically your storefront on walmart.com comma, so you want them to look good and perform well. Use high quality images, write detailed and accurate product descriptions, and make sure you're using relevant keywords. But don't just stuff keywords in there, make it natural and informative for the customer. A well-optimized listing not only attracts more customers but also helps you rank better in Walmart's search results. Alright, so, now that we've covered policies and listings, let's talk about inventory management. This is something that can really make or break your success on Walmart.com. You need to stay on top of your inventory levels at all times. Running out of stock can hurt your seller metrics and potentially lead to account suspension. Now let's talk about customer service. Guys, this is so important. Walmart takes customer satisfaction seriously, and so should you. Respond to customer inquiries promptly, handle returns and refunds efficiently, and always strive to resolve issues in a way that leaves the customer happy. Good customer service can lead to positive reviews, which in turn can boost your sales. Don't underestimate the power of a satisfied customer. They can become your best advocates on the platform, 